Hello everybody and welcome back to Gotham Lounge. My name is Joe and today we're back out with some more Red Dead Redemption 2. So Josiah Trelawney, who we just returned to camp, actually has something for us. Let's uh Arthur! Are you busy, Arthur? Oh, never for you, Trelawney. Well, I know you think I'm just some effete buffoon. What? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've... I found something interesting. Yeah? Have you ever robbed a stagecoach? No, never. I would have even thought. Of course I robbed a goddamn stagecoach. You know I have. And what's the problem with stagecoaches? The armed man attempting to put a bullet in your head? Not quite. The odds. I mean, is it worth the robbing? Sometimes. I know, but, well, if you'd like to come with me, I can introduce you to a new best friend, and he's, he's going to give you all the decent, robbable stagecoaches a hot-blooded degenerate could require. Well, I could require a whole lot. So where do we find this friend of yours? Rhodes. Because what can possibly go wrong there? Well, so we gotta be careful when we go there. Alright. Let's go. Let's go to Rhodes. You sure seem to have got a bout around here. You know me. I like to make friends in low places. How the hell you end up down here anyway? I could ask the same of you. I have a few commitments over this way. Some expenses to meet. Expenses? What expenses? Gentlemen's canes and rabbits to pull out of hats. Among other things, I had quite a nice little business going for a while. Shares in a gold mining company. Excellent returns for the investor of a certain financial standing. Until, well, that unfortunate run-in with the law. Yeah, that's how it goes. Thanks for disappearing on us during that Sean business, by the way. I've done my part. Each to their strengths, dear boy. You know, you boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. People talk. I tried to mention it to Osea, but you know how he is. Anyway, while they're off chasing their pot of Confederate gold hidden at the end of some rainbow, let me present you with something real. So, where exactly are we going? The train station. The clerk there, Alden, is quite a fellow. Here we are. We can hitch up outside. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. All right. Go ahead and hitch up over here. horse needs to be brushed. That icon kept going off. Come on. Hang back a bit and let me do the talking. We don't want to scare him off. I don't know if I actually brush the horse off. Pulled the brush out, but then he quickly put it away. Alright. Pull your magic, sir. Yeah, see, there's the icon. Hello, Alden. Hello, Josiah. How have you been? Dandy. And you, friend? Uh, like I said, times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The whip this of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Why do I have to pay the guy? 
here. Oh, dang it. Kind, sir. Call him Martha. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay. Well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, Josiah. It'll be coming south down the river road through Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. Oh, and Josiah, if you or Arthur are ever out Strawberry Way, ask for my colleague there. Feller called Hector. He's also one of the... What did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it. Discouraged men. I like that. Well, goodbye, Alden. Or should I say... Adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. What the hell was that? I thought you might like to see that pantomime. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. Okay. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. Try to brush my horse again. There we go. Okay, let's go this way. All right, following your lead. workers are in on it these days earning a pittance the unions are whipping them up so they want something on the side like he said there strawberry could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work I ain't sure about going back to strawberry after all that market business didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you so I wouldn't worry too much dear boy all this trouble you gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. Thanks. We're hoping to be long gone before that. Dutch has a plan. I've gotten a lot scruffier since Strawberry. I will say that. <laughs> here we are. This is the spot. Right here? Okay, this should do. Sure. Here. I'm hoping we won't need those. Well, better safe than sorry. Never what be too think? careful. Well, according to this, the loot is located in a strong box, which is in the back. I'll put on a little performance, and you can scurry around, open the strong box, and relieve them of their goodies. And how do I open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me? This should work. And I can do oh, this thank you. Silently? Well, I'm hoping complete silence won't be necessary. But you're going to wish you had your earplugs. This is Damson. Oh, very good, Alden. Very good. Of course, if anything goes wrong, you can wave your guns around like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. Give me a lockpick. Right on time. Let's go. Keep your distance so they don't see you. And. Please leave that gun in its holster for once. Can't promise I will. All right. Let's... I'll ride ahead and wanna... get the coach to stop. You hang back. Don't All let right. them spot you or you'll scupper the whole thing. Kill the stage coach.
gonna stop the coach. Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. <laughs> this will be a good distraction. Ugh. Keyword distraction. Okay. Loot it without being spotted. That box is wide open. Stuff is gonna fall out of it, guaranteed. Took what I needed, all that matters. I'm gonna wait for them to completely leave before I go up to Trelawney. Well, actually it's saying I can now. I just took out the sign with my head. Whoops. <laughs> Trelawney. Well done, sir. You well too. Done. That was actually really good. You did all the work. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, it's always good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. All right. See you soon. Take seven hundred fifty dollars. Gang share, three seventy-five. I get one eighty-seven. Nice. Oh, where's my horse? Oh, well, there he is. Hey, boy. All right. That was mighty fine. It wasn't a ginormous score, but it was a score regardless. <coughs> Excuse me. A score regardless. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and head back to camp where it's safe. There's Trelawney, right next to us. Yeah, he's going a completely different way. It is 72 degrees, it is hot out. Holy moly. train. Alright, so this is a nice little chill out mission before uh, we dig into potentially bigger things because if you guys recall in the last episode, Dutch has a plan to rob both families. Grays and the Braithwaites. And already the gang is split up into two different places trying to uh, plot maneuvers and what have you. Who goes there? It's 
me, Bill. the horse looking very good alrighty guys I think on that note I'm gonna actually go ahead and end the episode right here so thank you guys very much for tuning in today for this episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 here on Gotham Lounge if you guys enjoy the video please go ahead and leave a thumbs up on the video and feel free to leave a comment down below as always if you'd like to continue to stay in touch with us, watching future videos or videos of our past, just go ahead and hit the subscribe button on the lower right-hand corner of the screen and you'll get a bell notification every time I upload a brand new video. So once again, guys, thank you very much for tuning in today for this episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 here on Gotham Lounge. And you guys have a fantastic day.